What's up everyone and welcome back. Today I just want to shortly show you how to install Playmaker for your game. And in the next video I will also show you how to add the ecosystem which gives you uh, the option to access many many more actions um, to improve your game even further. So let's get right into it. Starting off we should go to the asset store in Unity. Here's the link and we just will search for Playmaker. And Playmaker will actually pop up uh, quite on top. It's quite famous. Many people have downloaded it. Currently, it's quite expensive in Europe or in Germany, where I'm located right now. It's 58 euro. And sometimes it's also a discount. So hopefully, you can get a discounted price, which would be good. Once you add it to cart, you will just see it here. And then you can download it or add it to your assets and then open it in unity and then it will just open you can just click here the link and open it in unity and then the unity editor will automatically go to the package manager where you have then playmaker so within your package manager if you already have added it to your assets you can just go to playmaker press import and we'll just import everything this will take a little while speed up the video here once playmaker finished importing it will pop up this playmaker window window in which you have to press install playmaker and the latest version the current official release is the 1.90 you just click this i made a backup go ahead this depends on your project uh, it's better of course to make a new project with this if you already have a running project make a backup of this project and um then install it. As you know, in Unity, sometimes things can go wrong and it's always good to have a backup of your project. Anyhow, I made a backup and I'm just gonna install Playmaker here. Let me just fast forward this. So after you have the final version now of Playmaker installed, the menu at the top will also change and it will give you the option to have the Playmaker editor um for some reason it pops up this window again let's just close that and let's dock this somewhere where you can start working with it i usually have it here in the bottom but whatever fits for you and at this point i can select any object um, in my game and add a fsm and start using playmaker for example doing the move action move object to a certain target and well in all the other videos it will be explained what you can actually do with all these actions well thank you for looking please install playmaker in the next video i will show you how to also add the ecosystem which will give you much more options thanks for watching